Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. The Curse of Oak Island Preview Has the team found a new money pit? A new structure matches design. This week on The Curse of Oak Island, the team begins examining a brand new structure on Lot 5 that appears to be the exact same design as the money pit. Also on tonight's episode, the guys date another artifact to ancient Rome and uncover yet another object that may contain the oldest metal discovered in Nova Scotia. Last week, the guys began investigating yet another unusual feature on the newly acquired Lot 5. On the surface, the structure appears to consist of a large stone circle with a big dip in the middle. The structure was actually investigated 20 years ago by archaeologists and Oak Island regular Laird Niven. He explained that the previous owner of Lot 5, treasure hunter Robert S. Young, had asked him to examine the feature, but at the time, he had dismissed it as being an old seller. It seems that Laird suspects he may have been too hasty and that the structure needs more examination. He's overheard saying, to me, it changes everything. A preview showed Laird and Alex Legina measuring the stone feature at precisely 13 feet, which is the same dimension as the original money pit. As referenced by the synopsis above, viewers can also expect the team to find more evidence of a link between Oak Island and ancient Italy. Last week, the team discovered a coin-shaped artifact that may have originated in Italy, and an expert discussed the possibility of an expedition setting sail from Italy to Oak Island more than 100 years before Columbus. This ties in with the theory that the medieval order of the Templar Knights may have transported ancient treasures and Christian relics to Oak Island. Earlier this season, coin expert Sandy Campbell informed the guys that a coin they had recovered dated back to ancient Rome. Now Sandy will be back in the war room tonight, and he'll tell the guys that he's 100 sure an artifact is from 5th century Rome. This is probably the coin-slash-token artifact Gary found last week. In the last couple of seasons, we have seen the guys leaning toward a Portuguese origin for the Oak Island mystery, but they now seem to be veering toward Italy. However, the Templar Knights would have had links to both Italy and Portugal. Also, tonight's show will prove to be a good week for really old artifacts as Gary Drayton finds an object which he states is the oldest artifact pulled out of the swamp. Expert blacksmith Carmen Legg will then tell him, it's the oldest I've seen in Nova Scotia.